Hello everyone, Ring Delancey here, and welcome to a brand new playthrough. Today we'll be playing as the West End Company, playing as Marco Colombo. Links to what mods we're using will be in the description below, but the main ones are Southern Realms and the Chaos Endgame campaign. So, as for uh, settings, it's going to be hard, hard. 100 to 150 turns. Chaos Invasion. Sea Lanes, etc. Oh, that's all good. And right, let's jump in. Welcome to Solar, ladies and gentlemen. Okay, so we got Marco Colombo here. Our plan will be to take over the coastline. What is your behest? And then we'll go from there. Now, we don't have access to our trade caravans that we would normally do until we have um, confederated one of the Talian factions. So we're going to do all kinds of wheeling and dealing to try and get this done. So it's just to clear and warn everyone's enemies. Greetings. We may not be the Empire, but our realm has riches and strength in equal measure. Yes. There we go. I didn't bother with uh, Belladonna's faction because she's at war with the same Beastman faction, so I can't do anything with that. Alright. You. I don't know if it's... What does the Emperor bid? If that would work. Now blame you, you. Raise your weapon. So what have they got? They've got a lot of anti-inventory. Spearman. Could resolve it. We'll resolve it. We're not going to lose any uh, any units. Get this early fight out of the way. And we can replenish if we need to. So we'll do that. We'll bring him back into town. To the provinces. Build some half bikes. Build the port. The money. And then we will go for uh, growth building. What? And as for here, we will go. F what are we doing? Global recruit rank. Attrition from all attrition minus fifteen percent from all attrition plus these three or professionals. I'll go with this one. I feel we 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 lack good troops early on, and um, we're going to need them against the Skaven. We're going to be fighting a lot of armies where we are outnumbered, and for the commandment, we'll go for growth again. All right, next turn we go and we'll jump over to the Order of the Horned Rat. So we have um, the Chaos Mod campaign involved in this, so between 10 and 100, 150, or hell will kick off. So we need to be ready for that, we need to have our, a good stronghold, uh, a foothold, sorry, in. We need to make sure that we have the ability to push back. And we've got a place in the Southern Realms under our belt as well, if we can take uh, Astalia, for example. They've already taken out that. That's good. Right, we're going to hire those. And then we're going straight over here. Let's 
See, they say close. I don't see it. Maybe because it's a settlement bell. Five away, it's ours. So let's level up our guy. We'll go for logistics twice just to get our get our armies back up in ship shape. So we're gonna be fighting a lot of battles and we're gonna need all we can get. Uh, flourishing sovereign trade. That gets our trade tariffs up, growth. Trade resources produced plus five. Income from ports, that's important for us, plus 10. All over that one. All right. I wonder what he's going to do. So these are the Pirates of Cytosa. They're a horde faction. Other than that, I don't know much about them. But it might be an idea Admiral of the to get non-aggression. There we go. We'll get 600 quid out of it. All bones on deck. Uh, I'll get a non-aggression from this faction. I've got a feeling they'll get wiped out quite pretty early on from Clan Pestilence. Decisive victory on that. Here we're going to build a garrison building just because this army is going to have to either go down here with uh, when pestilence eventually takes that, or I can go straight down here and down. I might go this way. By the way, I want to protect our flank. To the provinces. Praise Sigma. So we will go for. Skink contracts, that's uh, income from ports for local provinces, trade, and diplomacy for lizardmen, which is important, especially since we're surrounded by the buggers. We've got growth here, so let's go for public order again. Sorry, that wasn't public order, was it? Uh, sorry, public order, corruption, and chance of intercepting underways. Considering what we're fighting, I'll take that for now. Okay, so while there's nothing I'm going there, I'm going to charge over this way, I think. Okay, so the mutineers are gone. Yes, my lord. Sigma compels us. I have this army here. I will build another general just here. What's this? I 
will marshal the men. Then next turn, we'll go charge into that. It's fine, everything going on okay over here. No quick deals. Now, now. Press but I want peace. I see you drop. Oh. No chance. No chance. Think of a new name for the altar of the horned rat. So he's from Marco Colombo is originally from uh, Tarantio. So I say we call Ultra the Horned Rat New Toronto uh, Tarantio. Nice and original, I know. There's him. To battle. Let us move to the provinces. Uh, I'll take the duelist for now. Just uh, in case I've got any ideas, you know. Let's see what scroll does here. It's two stacks hopping about. Attack here. There's a settlement here which I think is owned by pestilence as well. So we're just going to keep reinforcing this army. Just in case they get any ideas. Ready. What does the Emperor bid? Alright. He's at war with them. So the sentinels. Yes. What you just said. Right. So we've got some money from that. That's good. Oh, that's not good. Alright. Continue the siege. Okay, we've got our guard post built there now as well. So we've got... It's not an unwalled settlement yet. We've just got our nice decent garrison. To the provinces. We'll have more or less a full stack. Ooh, okay. Raised it to the ground. That means I need to hurry up. That wasn't even Stroll that done it. Unless Stroll's here, he's not moved. This guy jumped over here. 
probably what happened. Your man gods and dubious masters have no place here. I mean, for five turns or so, I'll take it. I need to deal with Club Pestilence now. Uh, let's recruit the wizard. Where is he? That is fortuitous. Onward! Summon arcane artifacts. For Helden! Still Peric, still gonna lose two units. Attack! Unacceptable. You got what have we got here? What can we build? I'm not building armies here though, so there's no point me building loads of shit. I might as well just use this as a an uh, economic island. Build troops at New uh, Torinto. Since if I sell, if I buy units anywhere else, I get twenty percent uh, increase. So we don't want that. There are lizardmen here. They don't want to be friends. My madness. The skank lot. Uzguama. Skank dog. Alex. Sigma's will. Sig. We'll have to attack the settlement next turn. Regardless of what the outcome's going to be. We can't be plonked. Uh, stuck in a siege. Especially when that's about to happen. Shit. I've got Prey Claude launchers as well. That's not good for me. What's the battlefield like? It's not great. If I hide in the trees somewhere and form a defensive perimeter around there, hopefully it will negate most of their missiles. Forest there, forest Okay. My bullets drop. Drop. Wave counter. For Helden Hammer. It will be done. We are ready. We are Sigma there. 
Let's move you here. We'll form a little square here. And we're going to hold the in line. Hopefully. Let's play monks here. Let's get the boys in there. Oh, this so the rocket, their bloody catapults when it shoots us. Blessed with Phil. State troops ready. Yes, sir. We are Sigma's Damn those cowards. Get on back here. Yeah, that sucks. This is gonna suck. I have to pull Marco Colombo back. Lose a few turns of progress, but that's right. Oh, you've come back. That's nice of you. Draw! Now! 
No, no running. No bloody running. Not that I can see what the hell is going on at this state. Yeesh. And the Vendettas are the only ones that are really holding their ground. Kind of expecting it though. Now, now the warlords in there, plague monks are in there. They're gonna get cut to pieces in a sec. You're coming back, okay. I don't think I'm going to waste the rest of the time <laughs> before, before they end up um, finding us all, but... Still. Are you guys hidden? Why are they not hidden? Why are you not hidden? Okay, these guys are hidden. That was terrible. Well, there's nothing to be done, uh, to be messed with.
Right. Oh, they've just sacked it. That's... That's interesting. I thought they'd completely take it to the ground. Either way. I'm not in the best spot. Okie dokie. Just do it. Let's just get it over with. Take it. Occupy it. Grab those. Move back. Plus five melee attack and weapon strength when fighting Skaven. I think that is adequate. The spear gives me magic attacks. All right. Looks like I'm not taking that just yet. not going to bother fixing the buildings because if they decide to attack it this turn it is time. it's just a waste of money what is that symbol under city right they attack it again and they've taken it taken it okay Could I ambush them? If I bring this guy out, just in the open. How good is his ambush stance? So I'm going to put him here. The Empire. This will bolster the nation. Sigma compels us. I'm going to move him here. Who calls? Who calls? Let's see if they take the bait. Let's see if they take the bait. Come on. Oh, okay. Wasn't expecting that. <laughs> oh dear. I'll build a general in there just in case he decides to have another pop. You take on there and then try and push on that if you can. Oh, 
What's the garrison? The garrison is pretty bad, to be fair now. Excuse me. It is time for Helden Hammer. Yes, my lord. What does the Emperor bid? Alric's work. Thank you. I will take money. Want you to go back to town. Praise Sigma. To war. To battle. So we will do inspiring presence. Get more experience. We'll do training and for spells. We'll do wind blast. And for you, just root matcher. There we go. The nation calls. Speak sense of failure to the provinces. Yeah, it was. It kind of stink. This plague has not taken. What does the emperor bid? Alrighty. Oh, that sucks. As if the AI can do that. This garrison's back straight away. Uh, decline the attack. Where's he gone? Gone over there. He's done a runner. So I'm going to take that. Decisive victory. Just yes. occupy it. Uh, we will do corruption public order. You. I want you to go back there. Now I will marshal the men. What? Raise Sigma. Uh, I will disband him. We don't need him just yet. Yes, my lord. And then we're going to look at Praise Sigma. There we go. We'll start looking at pushing south with Marco Colombo. We'll start building troops, and we're going to look at pushing that way with these guys. Empire. All right. Deliver your message. What would you like? You'd like military access? Any particular reason? If it's just to give me money, then. I'll take it.
Okay. Who's this guy? No, need my warp token stash. By the comet. Question is, do I wait a turn? Get stronger, or do I just push? There we go. Lost one unit of pipemen, but we took this settlement and we beat Scroll. I will marshal the men to the provinces. Fair trade. What does the Emperor bid? Ready. We've got a garrison of 13. What have they got? They still have a building there. But we're not at war with them at the moment. So that's good, I guess. Now... These guys have a town here and a town here. Kinda want Clan Pestilence to start whacking these guys, but I think they may have taken too much of a beating from us already to be much of a threat. That's made it interesting. Alright. Deliver your message. Hello. Alright, so what do I do with this problem now? How about I ignore it? I can do most of my problems and then I'll just go and attack this town over here. Hopefully they bring it brings more troops back. And then I can deal with those piecemeal. Let's see. What have you got? Not try as well. We must. Let's see if this draws them out. Yes, my lord. It is time. I will marshal the men. To the provinces. That's a bit dangerous considering... There's two armies there, but... I think he... I can take that there. And I could take that. That would be the whole province then. And trying to get to level up. Let's go. Okay. Let's cross our fingers.
There we go, that's all... F What's that, two and a half stacks over there? Currently besieged. It's a decisive defeat. Alright. What does the Emperor bid? Time to push on this. We do get help from this um from our allies and that's good. Well not allies, but they might as well be for this sense. Alright. Let's come Pleston that's done there. As for our allies over there, uh, for our settlement over there, it's just a case of hoping, now. hoping they back off. Very much doubt they will. Might be a little bit pissed off. To strengthen the empire. Build those. So. Stink lot. Tomb king of the cross myers. The creator uh, You're at war with everyone, so I'm not going to do any of that. Deliver your message. Let's go for drawing war against Clan Scryer. How much money you can give us? Right. Thank you. Who calls? Praise Sigma. Let's hope their war's going well against Clan Scryer. I will marshal the men. What is Clan Scryer doing? It split its forces up. Two armies over here now. Two there. <laughs> Alright, well, I'm going to have to march north from the Sentinels of Time. I might have to do a force march and then attack with the garrison and then swing straight round here then hope that they just attack me whilst I'm in force march imminent rebellion I mean I can't do much about that On it. yes my lord Sound plan. On march into battle. Yes, ready. Yes, the nation calls. That's that. Ready by the comet. To the provinces. I will marshal the men. All right, so that garrison is still building. A lot of cat and mouse going on. That's most of my armies, but that's all of theirs. All of theirs. That's worked out. That's huge. 
All right. So, new plan. Gonna go after that. Unexpected. I was expecting all of them to come over. What does the Emperor bid? The Empire. What does the Emperor bid? I'm gonna give you those units. By the comet. It is for the best. Let us move. I'm gonna march this unit here. Gonna give you those. I will marshal the best. Your skills will be in control because settlement needs it. Now you I'm gonna march these troops over. On march. And they're gonna go help my guy. I'll bring these troops over. Was it four years of pikemen? Or demi pikes? Connoisseur, it's a security. Lightning strike. Same missile strength. I don't have a lot of missile strength at the moment. So I will go for melee. You leadership. I will marshal the men. Then evasion. And this should be all everything they've got at us now. Should be everything. Lots of this pots and candy nuts. Time for talk is over. Make your demands. And he would now like peace for 300 quid. Get out of it. Okay, so we've got our flourishing trade thing now up as well. I'll probably get rid of one of our generals after this. Um, once we've got rid of our initial war, we still need to beat uh, Clan Spittle when we get a chance. Set a door of dusk. Non aggression pact. So with that said, off we go. Let's see what they've got for us. Decisive victory. And for that, I will loot and occupy because I need the money. I will get rid of that straight away. Build that. What does the Emperor bid? All right. There we go. Let me need some growth there. For you. What? Uh. By Sigma, no. I'm gonna throw these guys in here. What is it, sir? Is it a gun? Oh, 
what happened to it? So it still won't answer itself. Not seen Lufa. Not known Lufa Harkon to go down this. Be this aggressive. Okie dokie. To strengthen the empire. Move back, you can disband. The nation calls. I'm right, just going to give him some extra goodies. Give you a sword of might, why not? Potion of toughness. Yeah. I am listening. Ready. Let's upgrade that. And we will upgrade which is the star tower, isn't it? If we're going for money, then we'll go for that. To the provinces. I want to bring the army the here. I want to build some troops. That's fine. We'll fight the rebellion next turn. We'll fight some troops and then we're going to look at attacking Lufa Harkon, looks like. Oh, there's a clan pestilence by me there. I thought they'd all gone. Well, that's a rebellion. All right, that's the rebellion. Ready. What? Let's bring him down here. Then we'll take this general out. War calls. There we go. That's rebellion dealt with. We'll take some pennies. The Empire by the Comet. Oh, that's quite a little nifty army you got there. May take it off him later. Uh, we will do corruption and control. We'll get the trade building trade. up and going. I will marshal the men. Dude, that that gets uh ten percent ammunition, six percent range, and ten percent missile strength, and that's for all infantry units in his army. So once we've refitted our army out with some decent missile troops, we'll be good to go. It is time. Because at the moment we've just been throwing our army of any kind of crap just to try and get rid of um Skaven early. And for a few turns at least, we've got time. Got a little bit of time. What does the Emperor bid? 
So as for research, we'll do Lycopsian Diplomacy, which gives us plus 15 to all uh, factions. Which is good because again we want to get the early yes we want to get the early um confederations however it looks like talea is already gone Sigma's will. which isn't ideal clan scry has two factions yeah sartos has taken all of uh talea it tends to be a 50-50 whether or not they fight off or not. Last time. We can try and get him back. We can do uh, rebellions and such. So it's not the end of the big guy. Now, are the Southern Sentinels at war with the Awakened, with the Vampire Counts, or are they just going to go up there? No, they're just at war with them. So they might go and have a go at the Skaven Forest. I don't know what they plan to do with that army, but, you know, give them props for letting them try. Okay, so... I'm gonna get rid of this um these uh these units here. Build those, build those, that, that. Fish bath wash. Yes. Three turns we'll have a much better army. Also have our regiments of renown back. Crossbows are pretty good at the moment. The cavalry rank seven. It's just our front lines aren't doing great. So we've got the regiment renown here. We've got the the leopard legion, leopard company. Sorry. Yes. All right. So far, I'm happy with how this campaign's done. We had a couple of slip-ups, a bit of a bit of squeaky butt moments. That's all right. I'm not used to seeing this in any Lustrian campaign. Normally, I'm used to them being up here and staying up here. The Lizardman faction have just walked into Leaf for Harkin's territory. So they're going to be taking attrition because there's a lot of undead corruption over there. I mean, that's a them problem, right? That's it's fine. So? As for this army, I've still got a couple of turns. I will marshal the men. 
I'm just going to hire those in a couple of turns, and then I'm going to go straight up here. And go attack Arkan. What? Where? Depending on what these guys are, think they're doing. That might work out for me. If they decide they want to go attack here, let them take it. I can then attack them. And I get it without any diplomatic penalties. Jobs are good. Little Byzantines as far as um, diplomacy goes, but you know, I like it. Yeah, oh. They're on my shores. Okay. So I will cancel these buildings for now. I'm going to march down here, rebuild them. So that's that and that. I still think they're going for here rather than going for me. So. Turn 21. So where will they go? What's a rat to do? What's a Skaven to do? Going somewhere. Do not greet me as a friend, nor are we foes yet. Mm. Okay. Not war with the Skaven, and so you stay in your mountains. All good. They have just up to move them. What does the Emperor bid? They've done a runner. Moving up. Right, I'm going to. Buy a, another unit of pikes, these are for the flanks, cavalry, and then we will have a unit of pikemen and a detachment of crossbows, one, two, three foot units. Okay, and that'll be a pretty, so I really can't wait till I get some cannons, however, we're not there yet. We're not there just yet. Good 
Greetings. We may not be the Empire, but our realm has riches and strength in equal measure. What would you like? Non-aggression pact. Uh, fine. I'm gonna fight Luther Harkin anyway. Might as well have some allies watch me do it. It's a bit uncomfortable having two stacks of Skaven just sat there. Maybe I should just get rid of him. By the comet. By Sigma's right. Ah, okay. Okie dokie. Let us move. That's where they're running. The Empire. Why they're running back. All right. Oh, they've only got one settlement left. That's greeting strip. That's not good for them. I had time. Yes. What? Hello. Sigma's will. And an Issa salt fight. Choose your next words carefully. Yes. Since my ally is already dead. Alright. Yeah. I am ready to parley. I hope your words are wise. No. I don't want them to loot. I'm not going to have any allies to uh, to confederate with at this point. Oh, my friends are leaving me. Now it's still possible to get our um, our allies back even if they are wiped out. Basically what we have to do is go over there and just raid and raid and raid and sack until they basically cause a rebellion. And then the faction comes back. And then we confederate in that way. It's a bit long-winded, but we're probably going to have to do it that way. Lizardmen have taken the blood swamps. Huh. Very cool. To the provinces. All right. As for you, I want to go here. Sound plan to strengthen the empire. This will bolster the nation. Okay. Next turn, not right now, because we need them. Um, I don't want to spend money when we don't use them. Praise Sigma. We'll hire our troops, and we'll declare war. Battle. I'll move him here. He should be able to take him on. He calling it a deckhand. My madness is not caught. Descent. Yes. Portal. Defender. 
I am the pirate king. Okay. The other southern realms, we've got the Eastern Company, which is near Shenyang, or is based in Shenyang. There's the Border Prince factions, they tend to get wiped out by uh, Wazag from the campaigns I've played. So have to see how we get on. I just want to have the strongest economy and army I can have before the inevitable shit show that is the new chaos end game campaign. Not to say it's not fun, but I've only played it once and I just got swamped. But I was playing as Cracker Drac. So that probably didn't help. I'm gonna grab you there. Yes, a sound plan. It is for the best. To strengthen the empire. Onwards. Let's build those. You. Extra money. The sea brings gain. What's that temple guard? True odds court. Those two and the blood swamps. No. Okay. So what's this connected to? What? It's uh, which I don't know where it is. It's uh, it's just up here, right? Yeah, it's just here. Okay. I might be able to trade that for a, a decent trade agreement or some peace treaties. It uh, would be a pretty good ally to keep. all the moves the vampire coast could do it wasn't the one I was thinking they would Okay. So let's see if we can get some money from Itza. So we got some pennies from them. Thank you. Love you very much. And boom. Let's go that way. We will just jump straight in. Say that summon. I will marshal the bed. Uh, chimp that down there. Praise Sigma. What does the Emperor bid? Uh, it says right there. Lovely. To the provinces. Here's the plan. I will take that settlement next turn. What? 
and then peace out and give it to these guys. And how much money do they actually have? A moderate. Moderate. If I could take that and then look at whacking that. It's about seeing what they do, what the uh, the undo the undead do in response. So we do that. Minus one corruption in adjacent provinces. So that will s start affecting here. The other option I had, depending on what the Awakened do here. Oh! Where the hell did that army just come up from? Okay, so we deal with that army first. And I'm thinking he goes up there, whereas that army goes up there. And we just keep the lock. Just try and keep the Lizardman sweet as much as we can. I am ready to parlay. I hope your words are wise. Okay. Don't be done. Okay, Mr. Bosses. Fight for our nation. Into battle. <laughs> Not this officer. To the provinces. Alright, let's. Excuse me. Get your own. Cost money to get an. Uh, allow your armies into my area. Do you not think it's worth you doing it? No? Technically stronger than me, so he thinks he can boss me about. And he is absolutely correct for the time being, he can do what the he likes. Yes. Sigma's will. Let's see if they, uh, The vampire curse go round me or through me. You come bearing arms. Oh. Is it war? He wants a peace tree. I'll tell you what. You can have one. It's gonna cost you. That settlement. No. Fuck you then. Where is he going now? Where's he going? He's on force march, so he can't go any further. He is stuck. Assuming I can reach him. Check out. Against the foe. But he can reach my settlement. That is not done. Yes, my lord. By the comet. 
Okay. He's not the only one that can make a threat. It is for the best. The nation you go there, you go there. I will marshal the best. What does the Emperor bid? The Toronto. Off you go. Yeah, these are just gonna mop up the dwarves here. And then we need to start taking out these guys when we can. Now who calls? I have time. But I ask that you be swift in your intent. Okay, right. what do you I am ready to parley. I hope your words are wise. Stadio is so screwed. It's very, very selfish, but I only want them for their caravans. <laughs> That's all I want. I won't be able to send caravans around the world. It looks like I'm going to have to declare war against Clan Scryer to do it. Ah! Damn it, they've taken it. Okay, so... Just have to push on these guys. Mr. Butters, come on down. So onwards. By Sigma's right. On march. To the provinces. Uh, do I have a... No, none of these are... Oh, these are by the coast, which means they're going to take... It's going to cost me money, basically, to keep armies or to hire armies from here. So let's just turn this into a economic settlement. I will marshal the men. Uh, I'm quite happy to have a non-aggression pack with you guys. Yes, the Sigma's will. Double next turn, and that should sort out the. Population problem. We just ignored Tim Butters. I can't see him doing anything though. I mean, he could build up a big, dirty army, though, couldn't he? If he's in that stance, which he is, he's currently raiding. It's a bit of a risk. A bit of a risk just leaving him out there.
Sword of Cain is being taken by Tyrion. That's... Sigma. Yes, a sound plan. Not the greatest idea I've ever heard, mate, but, yes. you know. Right, what is our garrison looking like? It's 11 strong versus his 20. All right. Let's see if he does attack. I will marshal the men. Let's see what he does. How oh, big is that garrison? That garrison's only thirteen. This garrison's eleven. Twelve. Thirteen. And that army isn't great. This is a walled settlement. It should be fairly straightforward. I do love a should. I do love a shirt. He tried to attack the general out in the open and got his butt whooped when I pulled back to the settlement. So that worked out. So that's a tactic to remember. Sigma compels us. Alright, so let's go for inspiring presence for you. The Empire. And for you. I will marshal the men against the goat. Now they're still saying it's a big army. We're just gonna sit here. We're gonna wait. Wait for him to come back. I'm gonna slap him the next time if we have to. Uh, leadership minus eight. Let's go for cavalry. No go for that, and then we will. Can't buy an armorer's guild just yet. So we will go for Let's build some units. Hey. Couple of levels up. Let's sort those out. So let's go for That this gives us more missile resistance and better missile strength. What? We'll go for earthen, which is minus fifteen percent for mist uh, miscast chance, which is good. Means our wizard isn't going to get turned into a crisp when they try and try, try and cast a spell. Other than that. I think after this uh, turn, we will see what battles obviously happen first, but I'll probably 
So after this has been a good part, we've taken a little bit of a chunk. We've taken a little bit of a chunk of, uh, of Lostria, which is good. We've got a few allies on our side, a few trade partners. Our cousins in the in the old world, in the summer realms, aren't having the best time. That's them gum. Um, but it could be worse. We did have a bit of a uh, moment with the uh, with Clan Pestilence at the beginning. Okay. The Empire. So for you, let's give you Root Marcher. And for you, you've got your Bided War Horse. Yes, my lord. That is not one order. So? So I'm going to march you here. And I'm going to march yes. you there. Just finish him off. The nation calls. Now, I don't need this many generals, so I'm just going to upgrade him and then I'm going to let him go. So I'll go to reset. And then when I need him, I will call and hopefully he turns up. Him, I will keep here as a basically a backup. If all shit hits hits the uh, hits the fan and they start marching down here, or hopefully have a general that can defend us. As for this army, I'm going to march him march. to the edge. And then we will see what happens in our next turn. Now we do have this, which will be good for our next lot of generals. Melee defense. Our next batch of recruitment for our residents of renown. Dust cost five grand. Money that we had have. I think for now we need it. We need any kind of um upgrade we can get right now. So let me just see All right. how our allies are doing. We are willing to hear it. They're still fighting. They're still, they're still in it. We receive you with the lady's grace. These guys, I will give a gift just to push along the um, the diplomacy. It looks like it's going to be her faction that I'll be able to take. That being said. Everyone is good. Everything's great. So that's going to be part one of our Marco Colombo West Indies uh, campaign. Thanks very much for watching. Uh, let me know what you thought. Like, comment, subscribe, all that jazz. Uh, it's turn 32 now, which means we are one third of the way towards the end times. And let me tell you, it's going to get rough. It's probably hilarious for you. It's going to be rough for me. I hope to see you there in part two in the next couple of days. See you in a bit. Bye-bye.